What's up, Fight fans? Being joined with the great and powerful Robert Garcia. Robert, how are you, brother? Doing great. So, uh, main event just happened. Boots ended up beating Karin. What'd you make of the fight? Look, it was, you know, he had a great performance. His opponent's a tough guy. Went out 12 rounds for the second time already. So, you know, it's you know, there's, it's a learning experience for everybody. You know, Boots is getting better and better. And, uh, and this is another fight that, you know, brings him to the next level. You know, a lot of rumors about him facing Virgil Ortiz next. Uh, can we confirm or deny any of that right now? Well, there's no, you look, he had he had this fight obviously to take care of, of business and he did already, but you know, uh, the rumors are, are, it's just what we've heard too. There, there hasn't really been any close talk where, where the fight's already been talked about and for any time soon but uh but yeah we're more than more than happy to to welcome him if he wants to go to 154 that'd be awesome that'd be a great fight you know given tonight's performance how do you see that fight playing out oh, well boots is a great fighter like i'm telling you he's got power he's got he's got good good uh good speed good footwork uh, i think it'll, it'll be a great fight but is also one of those fights that fighters that's very strong uh, he's a big boy he's he's got great uh great power punches great combinations so they'll put up a good fight uh, also, your your fighter Bam Rodriguez had an incredible win tonight. What'd you make of his performance? Well, you know, it, you know, Bam is Bam. You know, he goes out there and takes care of business. You know, uh, he was able to get him out early, and he did. You know, that, that's all it takes: one punch, one good uppercut, and uh, and he took care of business. You know, that that's just the way Bam is. You know, he's not gonna try to do anything anything uh, to to go more rounds. If he could finish it in the first, he'll finish it in the first. You know, you called out uh, Chocolatito in the ring. How do you, what do you make of that fight? Well, look, I don't know, I don't know how, um, I don't know how easy that is because, of, you know, Mr. Honda has always said he doesn't want them to face each other. But now that, that you know, there's been going back and forth talk, you know, about Chocolatito wanting the fight. Bam says he'll take it. Uh, but it's something that we will really have to consider, you know, especially for the respect we have for Mr. Honda. He's been part of our, part of our team since day one, since Bam's pro debut. And uh, we have to respect his uh, his decision too. But, you know, we'll see. We'll see in the next few few weeks. If not Chocolatito, who would you want for him next? We want him to unify. That's what he wants, you know. Mm -hmm. Honestly, he doesn't even... Uh, you know, there's that like he says. You know, he'll fight anybody. Mm -hmm. He'll fight anybody. That's what he said. He'll fight Chocolatito. He's not calling Chocolatito out. He just said he'll fight him. But uh, but uh, he wants to unify. He, you know, next year he would love to fight all three champions because there's three other champions uh, and and uh, and become undisputed. But uh, but if that doesn't happen, there's also a chance that he uh, that he might uh, want to move up and wait. All right. We'll see. Yeah, definitely. Robert, good to see you, my friend. You They're guys. about to start the press conference. Thank you, Thank you Thank so you. much, bro.